Okay, I knew someday I was going to have to stand up and give my lovely Claire away. Now, it sounds worse than it is. I'm just passing her off, but... <laughs> when I look at it on paper, I'm saying I'm giving Claire away. Okay. So you've all heard this. It starts out, you know, something old, something new, something green and blue, or however it goes, right? So... Now, here we are with that something old. You've probably figured out what it is. That scissors was given to me 24... Cripes. 24 years ago, on December 6th... Does anyone know what I'm going to say next? 1995. With the reassuring words, from the doctor saying it's okay to cut the cord. Okay, so I, I hope that that scissors that, that we've now passed on, that, that separated you two, will join you two. Is this a celebration or what? Is this a celebration or what? Anyway, Brady has grown into a hardworking, dedicated young man who has become quite a handyman. I couldn't be more proud of who he is and who he has become. Um, after all, look at his choice in a soulmate. Things do happen for a reason, and today the reason is true love between you and Brady. I want to end this with saying what I've said to my other kids' weddings. Uh, my wish for both of you is to be in love and to be happy, as happy as I've been for the last 34 years. Thank you and have a good time. Thank you, Mike. Priest said today, he says, Brady, you need to dig down deep, and your love for her, no matter what, will show. And I have seen that with him and Claire multiple times, and I'm glad he finally found the catch, because I was worried for a while if he was going to screw this up. Because he had a great girl, great family, they accepted her, and I thought he was going to ruin everything, and then also it's like, Brady, now we got to go on the hunt again, it's the worst. But they did both love each other, and I know they're gonna have a great future with each other, because guess what? I'm sticking around, I'm still gonna show up randomly. <laughs> so, buckle in for that. I know Claire and Brady are going to have the best life together. Uh, I know Claire might test Brady's almost already non existent patience <laughs> every day. She might spend a little too much money at the mall with me <laughs> and she might have a few too many golden margaritas at dinner every now and then <laughs> but I think that their relationship and their marriage will be able to take on any obstacle that life throws at them and if you guys ever need anybody else to lean on besides each other I'll always be there You know, Thursday night after the rehearsal, the two witnesses were signing a license, and Claire, you were taking a picture. Do you remember what you said? Yeah, she said, I'm sign they're signing my life away. <laughs> now, I know there was some humor in that, but there's a lot of truth to that, what, what's going to happen today. It, and it's very beautiful and profound. Uh, for those of you that have been married for a few years, you, you know that what it takes, marriage is not about yourself at all. Marriage is about how I'm called to give myself to my spouse and, and to the Lord. And if there's anything that I want a couple to take away from marriage preparation, it's this, that you can't do that without God.
present to you for the very first time Mr. and Mrs. Brady and Claire Andrus. Like Claire said, we love you all. Thanks for coming. We know we got support through our marriage, and we love that, so let's dance. <laughs> <laughs>